Hello everyone, this is Zeroist Trivia. Welcome back to the episode of our legendary Ajax campaign here in Total War Troy. We picked things up for episode 39 from turn 168. So we're about a few turns away from sending the whole world at war uh, since we are thinking about joining the war against Hippolyta. And let's first check if she is still at the war that we set her up with. Nope. She has peaced out. With Sarpedon. They're not friends, but they peaced out. Well, uh, that was expected. Uh, we tricked them into going to war with each other, which is, you know, only going to last so long. We are definitely prepared to, you know, we have two new armies that are super expensive and we're going to use them uh, to fight. And the reason why, hold on, let me get the level up first. Good Omen from Sacrifice, that's for army. I'm not going to have them do army. Yeah, might as well use them to take down Spy sometime, maybe. Um, yeah, these two armies are going to be ready next turn. And once they're ready, uh, our food is going to go probably close to negative 10k, I think. Because we have, you know, 16 more units. Once that happens, I mean, it looks like we have, what, you know, 25 turns to burn that down. But honestly, if we just keep fighting, it's probably going to stay positive. It might even grow. Uh, every fight will yield us some food. And we should be okay. Uh, our spy has not moved. Right, because we finished up Hector over here. I mean, we're technically ready at war with almost all the factions. Um, right now, there's a little bit too much pressure down here. We're going to have to launch our attack at the islands. So we're probably going to send them down here first. Challenge awaits. I solve your problems. I go to change their and they probably will launch their attack from the peninsula out towards the islands as well. We'll keep this one army here in the north. Uh, we're not at war with the northern neighbors. They have armies coming though from down here and he's in striking distance of this island. I think we just go for it. The spy can't hit us in the water and plus, you know, Hippolyta is not technically at war with us right now. Hmm. I'm guessing it's a prayer turn and she just got left behind. Yep. There we go. He's not supposed to move and she leveled up. So let's see. Ready Immortal. We want to protect ourselves. Only one garrisoned hero. Well, you're not really supposed to move here. Alright, we're happy to stand still. Odysseus should be moving. He went after Sarpedon to um, get that trait, which we did. I'm not interested in these units. I'm more interested in our Paragon units. I'm waiting for them to wipe that out, actually. I can't take on both of them at one time, though. That's the difficult part. They have too many stacks. Um, I'm going to back off to our side and let them attack this too move off man and just hide prepare an ambush ooh lots of buildings right when that big war happens unfortunately i think a lot of our holdings will get attacked and will most likely lose some land as we fight that is just the natural way so we can't really make sure that doesn't happen. We just have to swallow that. Um, bronze. Bronze is dipping, and this is relatively safe. Really, really south. I doubt anyone's going to sell down here to get us. So I think we just go for the super pricey one. You know, influence is great. Three county is great. I'm not trying to build up that food. Get that to tier 3, no special buildings, I don't really care about faction-wide. Stone. So, maybe this to slow down enemy movement. They already provided this, so I think we do build this though. Like, it's ready, it's ready level 2. Yeah, I think so. All right, this is waiting for that special building next turn, and I think we're good to go. Let's see what happens. Paris is our main concern. 
Oh, we had a spy assassinate. Oh, we assassinated a spy. I forgot about that move that we tracked from the turn before. Sending an envoy. Okay. Mainly. Okay, he didn't move. He encamped. He's waiting for his death. They might still invade us, but 13 men, given the quality. Depends on the quality. If it's good, it can beat us. If it's not, we can hold. Here comes. Okay. See so how March? I could rotate him down and then just gang up on Paris with the spies. That is amazing. Spend more time in bronze settlements, please. Right, so like for him, it's probably better if he just removes this army. And then here we have help coming. Like poor Paris. I'm not gonna. Mm. That won't happen. Can we assassinate Paris? That's my question. Is it possible to assassinate Paris? We could wound him, right? It's 100. <laughs> So he's going to go back home. And the reason why we want to do that is because he can cause damage to the units after uh, assassination. So we pretty much get two effects out of one. And I believe the damage is higher than Poison the Well, which has been nerfed so many times since launch. Right, but this army is just wrecked. Alright, he's not going to make it, but he's going to be close. And if they didn't attack That's us last turn, they're not going to do much this turn. We're going to chase him down. Not going to go to our mainland. Ah, the quality is terrible. Don't hold back. Ah, this is a mace user. Is it a warlord? Like a... I think so. Free the prisoners. My reputation grows. Yep, Warlord Commander. Right, these are the really cool ones. I am probably going to keep him moving, so happiness and everything probably be but uh, I don't know actually. I can't decide, so I'm going to maybe go for something else. Oh, we have more Warlord Commanders. Alright, they're good. He needs to finish his war up here. Up oh, Penthethalia. We're friends. Can we sign something? Here, let me give you a bartering agreement where I offer you like 10 turns of like 150. I wonder if there's a set jump here. Like in Three Kingdom, it's 5.0. I don't know if that's applied because this is the old um, Warhammer engine, but you know, 300 and 150 doesn't doesn't mean much difference to us. So let's see. I already. Yeah, went up by eight points. If she values the deal, she wouldn't go to war with us. That's that's our bet. Hmm. He's at war with a lot of factions. Well, we have a couple common enemies. Anyways, to battle. let's take this. Death or glory. They didn't build the Corribantes building for the Get unit, or maybe, or maybe you can't build it here. But I know it's a Corribantes recruitment site. They didn't have one in the garrison. This place is ours now. Ooh. That's special. The sea goddess see the sea goddess escape save Odysseus from drowning as he floundered at sea and will do the same for others. I wonder if this was given to him when he was with the siren crash on the way back from Troy. Uh let's see. He's not sacking or raising. I guess we have to take this side. Are we sure there's no special buildings here? Yeah, there is one. Oh, it just wasn't high enough level. Or else they would have a Corriabonte in the garrison. That makes sense. Well, we're going to boost it. We don't care about this. I don't care about stone at all. So it's going to be a garrison tower. It's going to be a special Corriabonte's building. And then we're probably still going to leave army here for now, just because the range of the defense will be better. 
Uh, obviously, we're trying to take this, this, this. There's there's two special buildings here. There's a Cyclop one. There's a Hephaestus one, Hephaestion, which reduces the bronze upkeep faction wide. Yeah, we're gonna work on that with these units after this situation is taken care of. How about you guys? I'm sending help up here. Maybe a little too late. I thought Paris was gonna be more of a threat, but now it feels like it feels like we're okay. It feels like I should throw them into this war. Alright, we're gonna get ready for the island attack then. You will have to stay here. Someone's gotta stay here. This is a vital defensive spot for us. Just to guard this region. So I can spare him and spare him to go launch attack here. Um, I could probably spare him too after he gets destroyed because then we'll be pushing offensively down this entire ring and then we should be able to contain them. So we leave one army here, one army here, one army here and then launch two armies because there's one up here and then I think I have four. Oh no, 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 we don't have that many because he's also here. Well, we'll have the spies. We should be able to push. Hmm. Not a chance. I'm just worried we're letting too many of them slip Rising through. To the challenge. Wise in war. <gasps> I think this is the turn. With sword and with wit. I think this is the turn we launch our attack. I mean, ideally they colonize this as well, but what is I'm their sure what is their confederation? Twenty two. Okay, so it'd be minus two. Uh, this might be the opportunity. I'll think about it. Let me first summon them. Son of Nectar. This could be a cavalry unit. Ajax the Great. We can reach. Good. I've got what it takes. Hit the road. Truest friend. So they have so few units that we're not gonna fight this. Oh wow, this is probably the unit we're gonna get. Centaur Elders. Wow, it's ten cavalry? I kinda wanna see it though. Alrighty, this is not hard. We just really wanted to see. Oh, I just really want to see the 10 cavalry. I'm not even gonna summon the horses. We're literally gonna actually face off the 10 cavalry. Uh, summon the archers. We don't have horses. They have the horses. I'm gonna face off the 10 archers just with the, you know, flat line of infantry and a very angry Ajax going after him. I wonder if he's on horseback, because, you know. Benthalia and um, Hippolyta can be on horseback. If they're willing to charge us, we're going to stand firm. That might be everyone. Here comes the cavalry. Bronze Age cavalry. Definitely a scary sight. These are archer units, I'm assuming? Yep. So they're just gonna pester us. There's no casualty here. No, you guys just had to go in front of the line, huh? Get back. Don't tease, get back. And since this is not three kingdoms, there is no uh, charge reflection. Uh, so we only do extra damage with our spear. There's no bouncing the damage back on them. Uh, but our archers are in position, so we should be seeing counterfire very soon. Uh, we're just gonna tank it since there's no actual casualties in this fight. Your warriors have spotted hidden foes. You guys are in position. Yep. Yeah. Now they're going.
I guess cavalry officers are just bigger looking. These almost look like giants as well. Alright, look at their size. Look at our size. I mean, this is not a big unit, but we have a couple of big units. Um, oh no, this... We have a couple of big units on this side. And this is our big unit. I guess we're still bigger. Oh yeah, we're much bigger. We're like almost as tall as the horse. I mean, which is right, you know. They are big horses, but normally they're about the size of adult in terms of height. Definitely not weight. Ooh. Just whacking them down. Everyone's so disciplined. Alright, let's test out chariots versus cavalry. I mean, cavalry is not designed to charge into chariots, or vice versa. They're both designed to harass infantry. Oh, the tall grass slows us down? Really? Ajax murdering Nestor's son. Poor guy. But I would imagine chariots would do better in this type of frontal charge. We are sturdier and we have, you know, axles with little blades on the side. I guess we don't actually have them on these. Not creative enough. Like, the strength of the cavalry is when you charge an infantry, human, you know, instinct tells you to get out of the way of the horses. Uh, but, you know, in games, the units are very brave, they just don't budge. And in that situation, cavalry is not really that important. I didn't even use any ability. If you're gonna prove yourself to become a cavalry commander in maybe Odysseus army, since, you know, Odysseus is babysitting all the Paragon units right now. I mean, once we confederate, we have Nestor. We can probably put him under Nestor. Everyone can get their son back. Achilles can get his son back. Ah, uh, running away. Oh, nope. <laughs> Uncle Ajax didn't give him a chance. The enemy hero has sustained a wound. So let's see what we got. We got item from that? That is not usually what happens, but okay. We can't check with them because they have um, no slots left, but let's have them move. Uh, we cannot move very far. We're trying to get to here next. Who has an empty slot? Odysseus probably have an empty slot. Ah, uh, it is. Noble Stratus, medium cavalry, experts in flanking, excellent ammo supplies, good range. I guess we recruit him. It's only gonna strain our food, you know, some more, but it's okay. Cool units. We should get the extra envoy, I know. But um, the decision now is do we attack now? We will have to colonize this ourselves, which would be a hassle. If we wait one more turn, do we lose the opportunities? Why is it okay, I think we wait one more turn. We get these guys into striking distance of armies so that we can utilize them next turn. Maybe, hmm, this is pretty strong defense holding. We can snatch this one. We only need one army here. Choke off that little gap right there, the straight. And then we'll go here. They will strike at one of these army down. They can't combine, and most likely one of them will colonize, which is good for us. He also needs a turn to get prepared to move. I'm sending him north. I think I'm still gonna send him north. Or maybe... Hmm. 
Yeah, I'll still send him north. I think the south will be fine. Even Ajax and um, Tulsar is heading back towards this region. So we should be okay. If we look at the distribution of ownerships, Sparta has reclaimed everything on the interior. They lost everything here. And we're going to just make the push out from here to clean up all the islands, I think. I know my duty. He's not supposed to move. All right, this upgrade is going to happen. We don't need good wood. We're just going to go with the unique building. We do need more food, so I'm going to pump that up. Ooh, finally, tier five all the way out here. Okay, so growth building is not needed anymore. We'll get rid of that. And then we'll pull you just build some faction wide buildings and we'll be good here. Uh, maybe go a little defensive. I think at this point, either we get rid of this because we don't need growth either. And happiness, we'll keep the happiness building. The influence, we don't need at all. Hmm. Sure. That's the only one that can help. And we'll also get rid of this. Food first. By my wits. Go back into hiding. This will surprise them. All right, we're good to go. Um, the only thing we could consider is doing some prayers. Poseidon has fallen. We will probably just hecatome him the next turn. Demoralize enemy units. That's pretty strong, actually. I'm not doing confederate yet. We're going to push back Capalta first. All right, we're gonna pray to the god of war before we send the whole world into a war. Let's go. Oh. They made the move. Paris's army got a replacement general and they're attacking our settlement with the depleted force. I think we can hold or at least I hope we make them hurt, so let's go for it. Alrighty, they're attacking from two sides. Not surprised. Um, I probably want to not fight here. The gaps are rather thin, so we could hold. We have the good slingers. We just can't get a flank out of this. Where is their javelin unit? They have one javelin unit. That's on this side. All right, the general need to get out because we know how strong the general is once they're outside. How do we, hmm, how do we create flanks? That's the problem. I don't know how we can create flanks here. The gaps are really nice and really small. So we kind of want to fight out there. But then if we fight out there, we don't get any flanks whatsoever. Alright, we're gonna gamble. We're gonna all in this side. Move him up. He's going to give his life defending this. And then after him, this. We'll try to slip him out from the left. I don't think I can slip anyone else out. I can try to slip him out. Like just go here. Maybe we'll give it a shot. Maybe these two, you know, let's call them two. Charge them out at the beginning. 
if they can. I guess you guys could also go for it. Call him one. Actually, why don't he just? Oh yeah, why don't they just go together? Wait. Uh. All right, let's just give it a shot. Um, run, 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 run. Yeah, they took the left. So it's probably better we went that way. Run, 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 run. See, I don't know if they can get clear into like a hiding spot where they don't get chased, but we can try it. Oh my god, listen! Go this way! Run! All right, never mind. They're they're not gonna make it. But they slipped out. I guess they just have to hold here. Leave us alone. Your hero is under attack. I'm gonna draw them back if I can. That way, at least he can go kill this guy. Yeah, at least we get one of them out. No question. For certain. I mean, if we go into the forest here, maybe we can lose them. Ah, uh, he's just getting dragged into this melee situation. You bet. Consider it done. Yes, I can. For sure. Go, go, go. I'll do it. You bet. Happy to. Works for me. Opposite direction. That'll work. Yes, I uh, can. Getting whacked. Naturally. Do Technically, we change direction better than Fine them. By me. No question. Heard and understood. Consider One of your units done. has no more ammunition. Oh, he's just gonna die here. I guess we just take this Hector's Chosen unit around for a loop. I guess we can't catch them, so we're gonna just rear charge these guys. He's giving them too many boosts. Oh, I know it hurts, but like, what can we do? We can't catch them; they're faster than us. Oh, they threw a he threw a javelin at us. Okay. Okay, as long as we route them. How are you doing? In our sights. Ah, got surrounded again. Right on it. I'll do it. Got it. Well, he got us. He got us one unit out there, so that that's that's good for him. And they're dying. They're gonna have to fill it up soon. They're out of javelins as well. Yeah, it doesn't look like a fight we can win, but it definitely looks like a fight that we can uh, make them hurt. We'll invest the ammo into killing him. I think that's a good idea. You. Um, do we want to? Go after him. We probably should go after him. He's gonna unbreak and then it's gonna hurt. So you guys kill him cleanly first. Let him stall with them. Try to kill who you can. Use our archer advantage here. He could get so many more kills if he just shot here. For sure. We can't. We don't. We can't get free. Your warriors are losing heart. Okay, he's getting dragged like into the fight, yeah. which is really I've ridiculous. Got this. Naturally, doing it now. 
Come on. I'm on it. That's why speed is so important. Not a problem. Yes, I can. Bad guys are just faster than you. What can you do? Alright, finish their general, hurt their morale, maybe it will help us. Your warriors have been routed. Alright, one down. Second level, let's go. Who's the target? Oh my god, stop killing us. You know, maybe if I charge or something. I have the charge speed bonus. I can get out of there. Oh no no no! That's not what I want you to do. Melee, charge, 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 charge. There you go. There you go. Get a little charge speed. Got them. And then somehow you know slip by here and let them crash into them. That way you know we can shoot from behind. Oh, we did it. I'll fix it. Keep For going, sure. keep going, keep going. No, oh, why did I do that? I'll do it. Right on it. Got it covered. Awaiting orders. Up this unit. In our sights. You bet. No question. Ah. Oh. I'll do it. Right on it. Attack! Go all out! Can you not kill him? Ready to serve. Fire, please? You guys have no friendly fire. Don't be shy. All right, if you guys are going to be shy, why don't you guys come here and, and fire on them. And just let them stall. I'm oh, getting kited, actually. They stopped to shoot us. That's how much faster they think they are. And they're right. Is he finally doing damage? Oh yeah, the kill count's finally going up. Look at that. Let's go. There we go. Threading the needle on this side. Fire, don't be shy. We caught them. Finally. We might have a chance. See, this is what we needed him to do from the beginning. Just like, snipe them down from behind even. This is from the front. 93 kills already. Hang on guys, let him shoot for a little bit longer. Alright, go wipe them out. Yeah, just shoot this one. This one's shaking. Come on, we're waiting. Ooh, okay. It's worth the lineup, I guess. Wind it up and break the enemy. Charge. Oh, he broke. Okay, never mind. They go take care of the general.
endless war. Wipe them out. 155. 160. Bring and over here now. Over here now. There we go. Next time, I guess we don't need to go behind. We can just go to the side. Works just as well. Although they're about to all die. On target. Doing it now. First, we gotta pull back because we, we know we're slow. Good to know how. Much damage I can do with the day general. I'm gonna hide him to the side, maybe over here, because they're going to the cat, the center over there. You have lost a unit. Okay, hold on. Let's wait, because if he can get here before they chase us, we can actually do this. Uh, no, they're chasing us. Go, 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 go. I should have threw one of them over here, just to buy a little bit more time. The setup was too good, let's to not do that. Mm, honestly, maybe we should ignore the general. Run! I know you guys have been running all across the battlefield, but you gotta keep running. Loop. They're just gonna let him free fire, I'll take that any day. Alright, they're coming back to us. I think we just go here. Alright, we learned that we can just create an angle like this, where they can't get through our unit, but then we have an angle to still shoot. That's a decent angle. Don't 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 friendly fire, please. Ooh. Are you What kind of arm strength is that? Knock this into a pin. Just watch me. Okay, that that's a safe shot. There we go. There we go. Hard to find a safe shot, I think that's what he's doing. No we shoot over there? Am I stuck in the pin? That's my other question. Oh, good. I was like, got knocked into the pin and like, got stuck. That would be worse. I can slip out and shoot from behind. That's probably the way I can do this shot. But they're about to get flanked, which is not good. To be honest, the general is dying. Getting flanked hard over there. Who's the target? Ah, oh, friendly fire. What can we do? Good to go. Ah, uh, this might not be worth it. But they. Hmm. 
Okay, that's a clean one. I think it's clear now that we have opened up this gap of friendly fire. Oh, that spear missed. Oh, that was a good shot. I think they're done, right? That's broken. Okay, okay, okay. Chase them. That was costly. I wipe them out. He's gonna throw a javelin at me once in a while. That's his thing. Alright, alright. Stop chasing too far. Give us a sideway angle. Who's the target? Bring death! Oh no 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 no! Guys, guys, that's not. I'm on it. I understand you guys want the greatest surface area engaged, but like you guys can't beat them one v one. You guys need my help. Don't cover it so that I have to shoot you to shoot them. You By Ares, your warriors are rallying. Really? Getting chased this far and rallying? Are we helping? Sort of. Okay, that's that's an okay casualty ratio. Alright, they're gonna break, I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna just shoot them now. They're not stepping on the flag, by the way. Alright, we broke them. Shoot them, shoot them. Stay with us, stay with us. I'm almost out of ammo. That's the other problem we're gonna run into. Mm, they bounce back already. The foe is capturing your victory point. Oh, they routed. Oh, okay, it's over. They gave it all. He's not shooting anymore, which is a little strange. Hit them hard! Can you... Okay, I guess we're in melee. Done. Fight to the death. End them. Nice. No, not enough damage though on the melee attack. He's at 230 at the beginning of this melee engagement. I don't think we can kill more than like two people. I think two is our limit. Ah, three. Okay. Ah, he's gone. Alright, next time we'll know to create that little side angle with the archer on the front instead of getting out there to the flank and getting chased down for most of the early game. Maybe we would have done better. I don't know if we would have won. The quality of units is still pretty insane. They didn't take it, which is good. Just a little bit of rebuilding. What a brave convo envoy here. Alright, he's on march. We'll chase him down. No big deal. I am interested. Let me look at the map. Did she colonize? She did not. You know what, I'll talk to you about this on my turn. He's back to rank 2. That makes Confederation a little bit more difficult, I guess. But if we're strong enough, you know, by the appearance, he will probably still say yes. We can host a feast in his honor too. Seriously? A 20 stack and envoy? Right, these islands are going to be dropping. Oh, he has leaden spear. Hmm, well, he can take it. It's, there's no way we're holding that. A couple unique buildings gone. Very sad. Oh, 
also this. I mean, this is the new wave that they're sending out because they lost all their ground in Sparta, which was pro and a con because they would be recruiting terrible units in Sparta and also wasting generals there. Now it's like they're coming from their homeland, taking our islands. We'll get them back. We have no army in Crete, so if the fighting gets there, it could be bad. All right, Sammy had Zeus's punishment. We had to fix a couple of things. Ooh, Tozer's army got the bronze touched by Hephaestus. All right, so we stayed out of the fighting there. I'm going to take this army out. I cannot do that. Oh, huh, he got a Paragon unit too. Make them pay. Let the captives go. Under sail. Epic deeds. Hmm. Up pace. I think we pull back and heal first. I'm not in a rush to take that. Uh, everything just needs to be repaired. Not a big deal. My shady skills are yours. Their next journey will be on Karen's ferry. Might as well target him. This army here. As you command. Bring their deaths. Send them packing. We're saying these two to Liminos. We're gonna capture Liminos. Free the prisoners. Nice. Wait, we got a one of our own bows back? Maybe we gave it out way during one of the feasts. Demoralizes the enemy, reduce enemy armor. I'm gonna do armor actually. Get going, man. War is my business. Get moving! Great. They didn't colonize? Oh, they did. Now it's wartime then. Now it's war. He took that back, which is not cool, but that was probably expected. He put five men? Oh, he costed him three of them, man. He had five before. I guess we'll be double teaming this. There's a lot of threats nearby, not gonna lie, but we should be okay. They need to hurry up. Let's get this going. Another very small group, fearsome warrior, said to be descended from Poseidon himself. Probably a chariot then, because Poseidon's linked to chariots. No, no one can reach him, right? Yeah, we'll go here. Truest friend, deadliest friend. We'll wrap this up and then we're gonna go wrap this one and then pop into the waters at the point and start going to war. Uh, down south we have no armies, which uh, it's gonna it's gonna hurt us. Hopefully they just go north. 
you know, Crete doesn't exist. Wavering loyalty. Uh, shielded infantry? Yeah, let's do that. I guess we just declare war on... Mm, Alright, we're gonna talk to them. I'm sure we can reach an agreement. Yes, we can. I'm gonna finally join the war against Hippolyta's Amazons. And you're gonna give me... Oh, maybe this piece of land? Is that possible? You just got it? Can't be worth that much to you. Uh, we don't border it. We have Edis, which I don't really want. It's food, I know, but like it's a piece of food that's like way out here. What if we give you Edis and you give us Skiros? I can give him a lot of stone. This could just work, and then we finish a province up here. Uh, I mean, eventually we're confederating it, so it's not like... I honestly don't need the stone. Wow, that didn't even budge. I also don't need uh, wood. Okay, never mind. Not happening. But I will join the war. It's happening now. You might as well give me all your food. I know they need it too, but we don't want them to be strong, remember? All right. Sounds good. No hesit. All right, now we got lots of target to fight. Lots of target to fight. So, let's just kick things off with this fight here. Odysseus, Odysseus army is going to lead it. They are Odysseus definitely weak from just the cat the kind of the colonization. Name. This is all free. Cut them down. Occupy this place. Alright, we're gonna use that as our save point. I think launching the war itself is pretty exciting. Now we're officially at this like almost world war status where we have to fight everyone on that side. And then we're also gonna try to confederate them. And then it's really gonna be, you know, Greek versus everyone else. And uh, that should be pretty exciting. So we're getting to that stage at the end here now. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it and see you guys next time. Bye.